Hey everybody, it's Andy aka Max Rider. We are back with another unboxing video. Woohoo! This one is from Chaosium Inc. I know what this is. So do you. Unless you can't read, which I know that's a possibility. Uh, I'm assuming everybody who watches this channel can read, so you know what I'm opening up here, and that's the point I'm trying to make. I'm not trying to insult anybody or say that you can't read. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to keep this light. I'm trying to keep it light. I'm trying to keep it as light as I can. And there is, as usual, Chaosium really well packs their products. They do a wonderful job. Let's see. Ah, here we go. They, it's double packaged and it is uh, very carefully and selectively wrapped so that you get your product in great shape. And that's one of the things I love about that company, to be quite honest. <clears throat> All right, so we're upside down, but here we are. We have <clears throat> a cold fire within. Whoops, I'm knocking stuff down. Stuff is falling on the floor. Cold fire, <clears throat> a cold fire within, a mind-bending campaign for Pulp Cthulhu by Christopher Smith Adair. <clears throat> <clears throat> wow, hold on a sec. Brendan Sterling sought answers in experimental past life regression. Unfortunately, his mind isn't the only one seeking answers in the past. Or his mind isn't the only one. A Cold Fire Within is a campaign for Pope Cthulhu set in 1930... Set in 1935, a missing persons case leads to the discovery of a foul plot that could change time itself and bring disaster to the world. A cult intent on unleashing the power of the Great Old Ones leaves a trail through the Catskill Mountains and into the very heart of the planet. Within the subterranean world of Kinyan, Oh, interesting. The heroes will be in will encounter forgotten secrets, strange lore, and bewildering inhabitants. Curious cities of gold, ruined temples, and dark forests are just some of the terrors that lurk below the ground. Yet, before the heroes descend into nightmare, they must contend with remnants of ancient worlds, unruly mountain people, and psychic devilry. Along the way, the heroes may find that going back to the end of an ancient city is the only answer. Perhaps in Lomar's doom, they shall unlock the secrets of both past and present. A complete six-part campaign for Pope Cthulhu, A Cold Fire Within, presents new rules and skills for psychic powers, new spells, details of the people and lands of Kinyan, as well as a new hero organization, the Open Mind Group, the OMG. OMG! <laughs> okay. Six ready-to-play heroes are provided. Fearsome monsters, otherworldly designs, and psychic powers all mesh together to present your heroes with an epic and action-packed challenge. Dare you step into the darkness of lost worlds? Supplement is best used with Call of Cthulhu 7th Edition role-playing game and Pope Cthulhu both available separately. Let's take a look inside this bad boy. Let's smell it. Ooh. I love the smell of a new book. Hmm. Okay, I'm not a fan of that first piece of art, but, you know. Timeline of events. That's very cool. I do like this. I like this art here. Here's our heroes. It can't happen here. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Uh... Past lives, future deaths. There's the first scenario. It takes place in New York City, apparently. Very cool. The crystals and the victims. Characters and monsters. Hold on. What's going on here? There we go. Oh. Ooh. Cats from Saturn. Okay, that's pretty rare. I like it. Ooh. Oh, okay. That's the, uh, that's the... Okay. I thought that was a messed up page. It's not. Wandering Minds. So here we are heading into the cat skills, apparently. Sagertes? Uh, Sagertes? Woodstock. Wandering Mind. Ghost's Conclusion. Oh, nice. So here's a map of the Endurondak regions. That's cool. Into the wilds. Into the depths. Oh, jeez. Yikes. Okay. Roth's Village, the cave. That's a short one. Lost World in Blue. Yeesh. That's cool. Dramatis Personae. Personae. I'm rich. Sea of Still Waters, Dripping Forest. So this is northeastern, northeastern Kenyan. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Since Kenyan at least reaches as far as the, uh, the west. Tribal lands, the Dripping Forests. What else we got here? Huh. 
Interesting. The Gyathen. I thought they'd be scarier than that. Creepier looking. Black Sun Rising. Jeez. Very nice art for the most part. I'm not a fan of these big full color uh, ones, but that's just me. Time Rescue. Time Machine. What? All right, so there's some time travel here. Oh, okay. Are they, how far back are they going? Farewell to doomed Lamar. Lamarian heroes. Oh, and then here's the collected player handouts. Oh, nice, these look great. Now, if you buy this from straight from Chaosium, you will also get the PDF for free, which is, um, which is, I think, a great, great offer. And I think it's a great idea. Tomes and spells are in the back here. Some new skills. Kenyan vehicles and equipment. I thought there were new psychic abilities, but I must have missed that. So, the two-headed serpent. So there you have it, folks. There's a quick, rough look at a cold fire within. Looks pretty cool. Hey, thanks for watching. As always, I appreciate it. And I will talk to you all next time.